Welcome back. Southern Oregon Swing Society has an upcoming dance this Saturday, March 16th. Joining us this morning are Kalina Reeves and Wendy Tanner from the Swing Dancing Group. Guys, thank you so much for, for being with us this Thanks morning. Thanks for having us. I know it's a little early. <laughs> <laughs> Especially with daylight savings change, oh, it makes very it true, very even true. earlier. Yeah, so uh, yeah, we're we're here talking about the dance this Saturday. What else can you can you guys tell us about it? Well, we begin it right at the start with uh, a lesson from seven to eight, uh, which is typical of all our dances. We like to get new people coming out, so we do that. And then the band Dupe Swing Band is going to be playing from eight until ten. Very nice, clean. <laughs> Anything, Dad? Uh, it's at Ashland Hills Hotel and Suites in Ashland. Most people are familiar with it. It's a great venue, a lot of fun. Very nice. And so can people who have never danced before still come? 100%, yes. Nice. That's what we're aiming for. We're trying to grow this community so that it is very vibrant. And um, so, yes, we gear the lessons towards beginners. And, of course, it depends on who shows up. Right, mm -hmm. right, right. How long has the Southern Oregon Swing Society been running? Uh, for a little over a year, I guess, I, in an organized way. Yeah. <laughs> a little More unorganized before that, but <laughs> <laughs> about a year. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Mm -hmm. uh, real quick, what are, what are your, your roles in this event this Saturday? Uh, well, I guess I'm the instructor, and this is my instructor-in-chief. <laughs> Very and we nice. teach the lesson together usually. Um, I'm the president and founder of the uh, Dance Society, and Kalina is our go-to gal. She keeps me straight. She's technically <laughs> our secretary. Um, we're a 501c3 now, so yeah. Fabulous. Anything to add? Uh, notice that we got our 501c3 nonprofit status, I don't know, three weeks ago, four weeks ago? So uh, we found out about that we long found ago. Out about yeah. It, yeah. <laughs> But it just opens up a world of opportunity. Our goal is to eventually offer free dances and lessons. At this time, we are still charging a small fee just to cover overhead costs. When it's a live band, it's $20, but the band just makes all the difference when you're dancing, so it's worth it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Then this last question before we, grow, before we go. Uh, do you have any other events coming up and people should be looking out for? Yes, we <laughs> sure do. This is the big one. This is it right here. Um, How about that? <laughs> uh, it's May 3rd, 4th, and 5th. It is our first big weekend event with dance workshops throughout the weekend and live music also throughout the weekend, also at Ashland Hills. Um, we call it our Southern Oregon Swing Out 2024. Fabulous. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having thank us. Thank you. <laughs> Once again, the St. Patty Swing Dance is this Saturday from 8 to 10 p.m. with a swing dance lesson from 7 to 8. The event will be at the Ashland Hills Hotel and will cost $20 at the door. For more details, visit the Southern Oregon Swing Society's Facebook page. Guys, again, thank you so much for being here. Thank, thank you. you. We'll be right back.